Welcome to Fantasy Audiobook, Chapter 6. Li Shu left the Spirit Beast Pavilion with a look of anticipation and went straight to the old dean's office. Dot dot dot. Bathtub. It's a strange look. The old dean held the design drawings that Li Shu gave him, and he was a little unclear. I'm in a hurry. Upon hearing this, the old dean also became cautious. The things that can make a genius like Li Shu anxious to use must not be mortal things, maybe it is related to her cultivation. This kind of thing is absolutely sloppy. Wait a minute, I'll do it myself. The old dean took things from the air and grabbed a handful of dirt from the window, and all the stones and gravel were filtered out, leaving behind the softest dirt. Xuanji generally pinched his hand, water come. Quote. The soil mixes with the condensed water to form the mud embryo. With the flick of a finger, a clay-made bathtub takes shape in the void. It looks just like a drawing. Fire. Under the high temperature, the moisture was forced out. Not long after, a bright mini small bathtub appeared in the hands of the old dean. The old dean didn't have much expression, but there was some pride in his eyes. Fabricating a bathtub is not difficult for him, but to be able to do it exactly as on the drawings, he needs to control spiritual power to the point of meticulousness. And he did it very easily. But the old dean was disappointed. He didn't see even the slightest hint of surprise on Li Shu's face. In Li Shu's opinion, this seems to be a very common thing. Xiao Shu, what are you going to do with it? Do spa. Li Shu took the bathtub and hurried to the Spirit Beast Pavilion. The old dean smiled and shook his head, spa. Quote, dot dot dot. Boom. Chu Zi lay comfortably in the bathtub and let the gentle water flow all over his body. A little down, yes, yes, a little down. I, right here. Force, ah, comfortable, you can do it hard, I will work hard. A little up, a little to the left. Ah, ah, don't say, your talent is really good. Every stroke hit my acupuncture point. Ah, ah, um, um, force. Li Shu's hands gently pressed Chu Zi's fleshy waist, and one finger could not press the bones at all. Is this really a talent skill? You're not kidding me, are you? Just press it. No lie. Lie to you is not human. You're not human in the first place. Oh, what nonsense, your realm is still low, naturally you don't understand. In fact, every stroke you press is in line with the heaven and earth. As he spoke, a snoring sounded. Chu Zi fell asleep again. The point is that it is too comfortable. Ding. Special task completed. Get 1 million salted fish value. Complete daily task. Return to the cage Jew, get 10 salted fish value. Chu Zi suddenly woke up, and a carp splashed Li Shu's body in water. The wet clothes clinging to Li Shu Guanghua's skin, outlining her graceful figure to the fullest. Chu Zi's eyes straightened, so big, how old are you? 14, what's wrong? Quote, er, nothing, you pressed well today, but there is still room for improvement, do not be discouraged. And then, Li Shu darkened her face and gritted her teeth and asked, no, I still have business, you can step down. Are you still in business? Retire, is that the end of it? I pinched your back for a long time, and then you asked me to stand down. The key is that I don't feel the spa you said, what is mysterious about it? So when will you sign me up? What's the rush? Don't worry, I will never sign a contract with someone else. Quote. Including you, of course. The last sentence Chu Zi did not say because he knows Li Shu too well. According to the way he used to write novels, people like Li Shu are definitely female pig's feet. She is beautiful, has a matchless temperament and is very talented. Pig's feet, male or female, must have a tragic past. The first ingredient in becoming a pig's foot is to sacrifice everything you can sacrifice, including but not limited to sacrificing their parents, teachers, and friends. Secondly, the growth of pig's feet must be accompanied by pain. But the pig's foot will not die, the pig's foot will die, who will save the world? If the pig's foot does not die, it must be his friend who dies, otherwise how can the pig's foot grow into a decisive killing powerhouse? Looking at Li Shu's cold appearance, it didn't look like she had friends. The only thing that could die was her contract beast. Gee, whoever is the contract beast of her is finished. The names of the pig's feet vary, but their heels are the same. The word Zhang Xing, the number of Qiyu Jushi. Chu Zi didn't want to be killed, so he wouldn't make a contract with Li Shu. Quiet, salted fish becoming stronger is his way to survive. 
Then I go. How else? I'm tired today. There are other things to do. You stand down. Lee. Shu hated her teeth, but there was nothing she could do. The IQ can be high to this extent, and it also comes with natural skills, and the qualifications of the little beast are comparable to the four ancient divine beasts. Either way, be sure to contract him. You promise me that you can't contract anyone else. Ah, I promise I promise. I definitely don't contract with anyone other than you, can I step down? Quote. You. Li Shu walked to the door of the spirit beast pavilion with a black face, but stopped again. Turning around, he threatened, if you dare to speak and contract someone else, I will directly dominate your contract. You sign one, I will slaughter one, and when the king of heaven comes, I will also slaughter. Words follow the word, and the murderous aura is pervasive. A gust of wind rolled up on the flat ground of the spirit beast pavilion, and all the spirit beasts fell to the ground, shivering. Duh, the wooden door was slammed shut, and the entire spirit beast pavilion shook. After Li Shu left for a long time, the spirit beasts looked at the door with a palpitation. It's scary. Chu Zi secretly swallowed his saliva, and also had such thoughts. It's scary. If I don't contract her, will she even kill me? Let's drag it out first. If you can't drag it out, you have to find a substitute for the dead ghost in advance. After having a calculation in his heart, Chu Zi clicked on the mall. Salted fish value. 1,085,000. Looking at the million salted fish value, Chu Zi almost laughed. Although the million saltfish value is still two galactic miles away from the salted fish value required to upgrade to SSS, the special mission gives him hope of transforming into a human form. What is good to buy? Magic weapon. Nothing useful. Exercises. Still useless. Continue to choose elixir evolution. Life Attribute Dan Asterisk 65 Strength Attribute Dan Asterisk 100 Agility Attribute Dan Asterisk 100 Stamina Attribute Dan Asterisk 100 Spirit Attribute Dan Asterisk 100 Defense Attribute Dan Asterisk 100 Recovery Attribute Dan Asterisk 100 Click All to Serve Ding Host Successfully Upgraded Reward 5 Element Attribute Dan 1 Get Salted Fish Value 100,000 Current Level E Current all attributes, 1000. Remaining salted fish value, 947,085. Pickup truck. It has been upgraded by one level, but the value of salted fish has not decreased much. The salted fish value required for early promotion is still small, but after reaching the B level, I am afraid that the million salted fish value is simply not enough. Do you want to continue to upgrade or buy some equipment first? Continue to upgrade. Anyway, you will not choose the contract owner in a short time, first upgrade to extend the life. The most important goal is to become a divine beast as soon as possible, transform into a human form. Spend 700,000 salted fish value, and raise the bloodline to D level. After taking the 5 elements attribute pill rewarded by the system, Chu Zi opened his information panel. Host. Chu Zi. Race. Beast. Age. 3 years old. Bloodline. D plus, skill, million volts, realm, level 4 and 0 layers, attributes, click to expand, agility, 10,000, strength, 10,000, physical strength, 10,000, closing square bracket, opening square bracket, spirit, 10,000, life, 10,000, defense, 10,000, recovery, 10,000, 5 element, attribute, wood yin yang attribute, none, closing square bracket, Space-time attribute. None. Chapter 7. Xiaoshu, what do you say as a strong person? The old dean and Yan Yushi asked. Control everything in the world and guard the stability of the Terrans. Good, good. I am very pleased that you have this realization. The old dean brushed the long beard on his chest and was very satisfied with Li Xu's answer. Immediately afterwards, the old dean's words changed. Then how can you become the strong person in your mouth? Li Shu frowned and refused to speak. This question is too mentally retarded. Mentally retarded to the point that she was too lazy to answer. It's like asking Jordan, how do you think it's good to play basketball? Go and ask Tyson, what do you think is boxing? Go and ask those little fresh meat, what do you think is a girl cannon? Go and ask the female emperor, what is a strong person? No one knows how to be a strong person better than Li Shu, and he is an emperor-level powerhouse independent of heaven and earth. Seeing that Li Shu did not speak, the old dean sighed. 
talent and hard work are indispensable. There are thousands of geniuses in the world, but it is rare to grow into a strong person. There are many reasons, either not seeking to improve and wasting talent, or dying prematurely and failing to realize their talent. Xiao Xu, do you understand what I mean? Li Xu shook her head. She really didn't understand what the old dean was trying to say. The strong, the reason why they become strong. It was they who cashed in on their talents. Xiao Xu, don't hide from you. After I became the dean of the Exploding Heaven Academy, I also met many so-called geniuses, but no one can match half of you. Your talent is the top in the entire Tian Yuan continent. In addition to spirit beasts, our royal beast master's own cultivation is equally important. Listen to my advice. Signing an A-grade spirit beast and improving yourself with it is the right way. Although that G-level spirit beast is very cute and cute, it is still that sentence, Mo is cute and undead enemies. Don't delay yourself because of it. The old dean turned his back and let out a long sigh, but his tone was very kind. He was afraid of hurting Li Xu's self-esteem. The more genius, the more extreme the thinking, and the slightest carelessness may have an irreparable impact on Li Xu. Oh, I'm leaving, I'm pretty busy. Old dean, feelings, you didn't listen to a word. Are you busy? I heard Jung Bojin say that you didn't come out of the Spirit Beast Pavilion every day during the day, and you didn't practice at all. Helplessly, the old dean had to patiently persuade. Xiao Xu, I know that you are now at the age of playfulness, but cultivation cannot be left behind. In this way, you first raise the realm to an intermediate cultivator, and I will no longer care about the rest. Quote. The old dean put forward a condition that he thought was very harsh. Although the intermediate cultivators are not very strong, they are already a big challenge for new students. Of course, the old dean did not intend to use intermediate cultivators to restrict Li Xu, which was unrealistic. He just wanted to give Li Xu a goal and let her take it in. Oh, I have to go back to rest, and tomorrow I have to go to the Spirit Beast Pavilion. Old dean, are you taking what I say as a fart? This time, the old dean's tone was a little harsher. Xiao Xu, you are not allowed to go to the Spirit Beast Pavilion before you reach an intermediate cultivator. Afraid of hitting Li Xu, the old dean added, I'm here for your own good. Li Xu did not speak, but only released his spiritual power slightly. Duh, the teacup held in the old dean's hand shattered. The old dean froze. At that moment, he seemed to be facing the emperor of the Terran race. Although Li Xu's realm was not very high, only barely to the strength of the spirit level, her spiritual power gave the old dean a mountain-like pressure. Wait a minute, spirit level, lying groove, Xiao Xu, you are now a spiritual level cultivator. What is this, how did you become a spirit level cultivator? Weren't you a trainee monk when you first arrived? Elementary, intermediate, advanced, and spirit levels have all broken through. You're a ghost, aren't you? Rao is the old dean who is accustomed to seeing geniuses, and he was also shocked by Li Xu for 10,000 years. Less than a month after a freshman enrolled in school, he is already a spirit level cultivator. This is already catching up with many students who are about to graduate. Li Xu looked calm, but her eyes were a little lonely. It was very good to break through before the spirit level, but the real difficulty was the realm after the king level. Moreover, her current combat power could not reach the spirit level she expected, after all, she did not have a magic weapon that she was proud of. Li Xu, are you willing to worship me as a teacher? I'll teach you to cultivate. Li Xu shook her head and did not speak. She doesn't need a teacher. Because she has the memory of her previous life, as long as she walks again according to the previous path, she will still be the high-ranking female emperor. The memories of her past life are the best teacher for her. Seeing Li Xu's refusal, the old dean was full of loss. A moment later, a bold idea appeared in the old dean's mind. Or, I worship you as a teacher, and you teach me how you cultivate. Quote. No way, Li Xu's cultivation speed is too fast. The old dean was also stuck at the imperial level, and he had not made the slightest progress for many years. If he could, why wouldn't he want to break through? You don't have to. Li Xu's expression was still cold. However, if you don't understand anything, you can pick a time when I have time to ask me. Li Xu has this confidence. Although the realm is low, she has a lot of experience. It's still no problem to guide an imperial cultivator. So when are you free? Wait until I finish signing the spirit beast, 
don't look for me until then, I don't have time. Quote dot dot dot. A, okay, but, Xiaoshu, you know, I, at this age, I'm older. Well, people, all have a good face, be guided by you. It's nothing, but it's okay. Speaking of it, it might be a little ha, you. I'm leaving. Looking at Li Xu's departing back, the old dean muttered in his heart, did she understand this? Li Xu didn't understand. Although she is a female emperor, she does not pay much attention to interpersonal relationships. With her strength, there is no need to pay attention. Let you conspire in every way, and I will break it by myself. The way of the king, the way of the female emperor. However, the female emperor also has something that she can't understand. For example, why didn't that little goose yellow beast sign up with me? How can I get it to sign me? It's a divine beast. The divine beast is human, and once the contract is successfully signed, it will save a lot of communication time and can be used as immediate combat power. Right, divine beasts are human. Li Xu's eyes lit up at once. Like humans, divine beasts are greedy. Take its greed as a breakthrough and take it down in one fell swoop. But what does it like? It is three years old, and it should be fifteen or six if you change to an adult, right? This age is almost puberty. What do people in this age group like? Li Xu thought for a moment that when she was fifteen years old, she didn't seem to be interested in anything other than cultivation. However, she vaguely remembers that at that time, people her age seemed to be falling in love. Pregnant. After figuring this out, Li Xu wiped the sweat from her forehead. In order to sign a spirit beast, it is simply more tiring than a big war. After making a strange gesture with her right hand, the surrounding spiritual power frantically gathered into her body. Overnight retreat. Before dawn, Li Xu disappeared into the darkness. When she appeared again, she was already standing at the door of the spirit beast pavilion. In his right hand he holds a small rabbit dyed goose yellow with a large bow tied on the top of his head. Carrying a hamster, also dyed goose yellow, on the left and right was a large hairpin pinned to the fuzz. Chapter 8 With a creak, the door opened. Seeing Li Xu's arrival, the spirit beasts worked harder. Fire properties in smoke, water properties in spray, earth properties in mud. The spirit beasts are showing their talents as much as possible. Li Xu walked straight to the goose yellow beast. Not surprisingly, he was sleeping. His sleeping posture lacks the majesty of a divine beast. Normally, sacred beasts are lying on their stomachs when sleeping. First, you can stand up at any time to guard against unknown dangers. Second, the abdomen is relatively soft, and lying on your stomach can protect your soft abdomen. What about him? Lie down and sleep. Sleep on all fours. In order not to arouse Chu Zi's disgust, Li Xu stood straight in front of him with two small beasts. Wait for him to wake up. Gradually, a light smile appeared at the corner of Li Xu's mouth, which was very charming. He, indeed, is lovely. The body is soft and fleshy. Covered with warm goose yellow fluff, it is soft and smooth. The ears are thin and long, and they are very comfortable to the touch. Too little blush or even more glamorous in the morning light. Li Xu stretched out her hand and wanted to hold him in her arms and take pity. In the previous life, she was the female emperor. At a glance, you are facing the enemy. In order not to let the enemy find her flaws, she disguises her emotions and never reveals her emotions in front of people. Even in this life, she still retains such a habit. However, in the face of this cute little beast, she has almost lost control of her emotions several times. Exclamation mark. As for the spa that the little beast said, she really studied it after she went back. Conclusion. Nothing works. When he didn't speak, when he lay quietly, he was really a cute thing in the world, and unconsciously aroused the emotions that Li Xuchen had sealed in his heart for a long time. But as soon as he spoke, he always let Li Xu break his defense. How nice it would be if you were dumb. Poof. After speaking, Li Xu herself was happy. A smile melts all the frost in the world. Ding. The system alarm goes off on time. Daily sleeping task completed, get 10 salted fish value. Confused and opened his eyes, Chu Zi froze. Li Xu always gave people a cold feeling, as if he hadn't seen her smile yet. In this regard, Chu Zi did not feel that there was anything wrong. Because the pig's feet in his books are generally unsmiling. Otherwise, the pig's foot is not forced enough, and it will be sprayed as a dog by the reader. 
Li Shu is the same, and even more. However, she actually laughed now. It turns out, dot dot dot, isn't she paralyzed, so she is still not a pig's foot. Isn't she supposed to be a vicious supporting actress? Generally, vicious supporting actresses don't have much good juice to eat. The light ones were divided into corpses, and the heavy ones were used as knives to cut the face. Moreover, in order to cut the grass and remove the roots, the pig's foot absolutely must eradicate all the forces of the supporting characters. Otherwise, the pig's feet will be sprayed with the virgin. As her contract beast, the ashes have to be raised by the villain. This is all common sense for writing books, and Chu Zi, as the author of The Street, still understands it better. However, she is so beautiful, will it be a little too much to be a female match? The more you look at it, the more beautiful it gets. What are you thinking? Why are you still drooling? Hungry. Okay, why are you here today? Chu Zi casually coped and glanced at the two small beasts in Li Shu's hands. It's fluffy, it's quite cute, and it should be delicious when grilled. I see that you don't have much to do every day except sleep in a daze, presumably you are very lonely, right? When Li Shu said this, Chu Zi really felt lonely. Salted fish is really good, but there is not even a single person to talk to all day. If only you had a mobile phone, it wouldn't hurt to lie down for the rest of your life. There is nothing to brush up on the drama, find a few netizens to match the line, that life is called moisturizing. I knew you were lonely, so I found you two companions. Saying that, Li Shu squatted down and came to Chu Zi. Wow, so fragrant. Without waiting for Chu Zi to sigh too much, Li Shu's eyes bent into a crescent moon, holding a hamster with a hairpin in her left hand, and a rabbit with a bow in her right hand, and whispered, it's all female, it's beautiful. Chu. Zi's heart fluttered, and his eyes never left the corners of Li Shu's mouth. As for what Li Shu said, he didn't hear it at all. Quote dot dot dot, pretty, so pretty, so beautiful. Upon hearing this, Li Shu was even happier. I think it's all so beautiful, if you contract with me, I'll let these two little beasts be your wives, okay. Chu Zi, what's the thing? What are you talking about? You're going to make these two things my wife. Li Shu smiled and nodded seriously. Something is wrong with your brain, right? You really have a brain problem, no, are you insanity? Why do you think I'd like this thing? Li Shu was stunned by what he said and was puzzled. Didn't you just say beautiful? You don't have to be shy with me, really, it's not a big deal, your age is when youth is budding. And I checked the information last night, it's spring, it's the season for all things to revive animal mating, how intimate I am, and I found you too. Chu Zi was stupid. What I just said beautiful is about you. You wouldn't really treat me like Pikachu, would you? Chu Zi huffed. Although he is Pikachu's body, he has always regarded himself as an adult psychologically. And he has been trying to salt fish in order to transform into a human form. Hearing Chu Zi's praise, Li Shu's heart actually rose up with a different feeling. Me, am I pretty? Quote, other people's evaluation of her has always been talented, powerful, invincible, female emperor, and Chu Zi, who said to her face, was the first to say that she was beautiful. It's not that others don't want to say she's beautiful, but they don't dare. In case she said something beautiful, the female emperor mistakenly thought it was a tease, and did not raise the ashes of the other party. Li Shu's face turned slightly red, and a light smile appeared at the corner of her mouth. The royal sister smiled, life and death are unpredictable. Chu Zi felt that he was almost drunk. Your name is Pikachu. Then I'll call you Xiaopi in the future, right? Xiaopi, as long as you are willing to sign a contract with me, I will find you a good-looking little beast like me. Pick. Good leather. You are real leather. Chu Zi's face became darker and darker, and corrected. First, Pikachu is just my race. Nor is it, my current ethnicity to be exact, not my name. Second, if you want to find me this kind of thing again, you don't have to think about signing a contract with me in this life. The more Chu Zi looked at the two little beasts, the more he felt that he was stunned. Then you have to have a name, you have yellow fluff all over your body, call you Xiaohuang. Chu Zi didn't speak with a black face. Doesn't sound good, you look so cute, do you want to call you Xiao Ai? Quote. How is Xiao Ai? Li Shu smiled and rubbed Chu Zi's hairy head, ignoring that Chu Zi's face had darkened into the bottom of the pot. Just rubbed twice, Li Shu's face immediately changed, and when he looked at Chu Zi again, he looked shocked. 
Chapter 9 Li Shu's hand froze in the air, and she looked at the little beast in front of her in disbelief. Dual attributes, grade D, what's going on? This can't be, Li Shu muttered, unable to believe it. But her perception doesn't lie. She could clearly perceive that Chu Zi's wood attribute had become a dual attribute of wood and water. Xiao I, weren't you still a single attribute yesterday? Also, how could you possibly break through so quickly? Break through from F to D in one night? You're a ghost, aren't you? This is not in line with common sense, nor is it in line with Li Shu's understanding of spirit beasts. Normally, even a divine beast could not have such a fast cultivation speed. The reason why divine beasts become divine beasts is because they have great room for growth. Ordinary spirit beasts are trapped in the shackles of their bloodlines, and there is always an end. The divine beast did not. Without a big surprise, as long as the divine beasts are given time, they can break through to the SSS sooner or later. The premise is to give them time. What about Xiao Ai? Level up three levels in one night. It's so fierce. Pai slammed into me. Li Shu called out to see a ghost. She now finally felt how the old Dean felt when he saw her. Ah, you said this, you have a share of the credit. Upon hearing this, Li Shu suddenly woke up, you mean spa. Yes, Chu Zi didn't lie, he couldn't complete the special task without spa. If you can't complete the special mission, you won't be able to get a million salted fish value, and you won't be able to buy attribute pills to upgrade. But Li Shu doesn't think so. She deduced it seriously last night. Spa can only activate the meridians, and it is impossible to increase the level of spirit beasts. Unless, Xiao Ai's body structure is too special. Different from ordinary beasts. The first divine beast. Must sign. Do you agree or not? Or what do you want? Don't you want to see the outside world? The outside world is wonderful. Li Shu's mouth was about to wear out, but Xiao Ai's attitude was very resolute. Just don't sign it. But the outside world is also helpless. I'm waiting for you quietly here. As he spoke, Chu Zi sang, the outside world. It is impossible to say that you are not impressed by the outside world. It's just that Li Shu's sense of existence is too strong. Such people are guaranteed to be vicious supporting actresses. Or directly the female pig's foot of this world. Either way, following her is absolutely dangerous, and the slightest mistake may lead to death. Although staying in the Spirit Beast Pavilion is a little slower to upgrade, it is so safe. Dog life matters. Chu Zi's singing echoed in Li Shu's mind. The melody is soft and has a faint sense of sadness. Li Shu sighed and hummed softly along with Chu Zi's singing. The outside world is wonderful, the outside world is helpless. I'm still waiting for your return. Dot 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 dot. After a moment of silence, Li Shu decided to expose her identity as a female emperor. She didn't want to drag it on any longer. Xiao I, in fact, I am the female emperor. Ding. Li Shu's singing makes the host physically and mentally happy, in line with the meaning of salted fish, and activates special tasks. Close black lens bracket. Open black lens bracket special mission. Listen to Li Shu sing, only you. Close black lens bracket open black lens bracket mission reward. 2 million salted fish value close black lens bracket. I am actually a female emperor. Afraid that Chu Zi didn't hear it, Li Shu repeated again. However, Chu Zi's eyes were empty, and he was still pondering the special task issued by the system. It turns out that her name is Li Shu. Only you. Is that the one that oh oh oh, oh your mother's size? Chu Zi tried to remember. In the impression of, Journey to the West, the song that Tang Monk almost sang Sun Wukong to death is called Only You. Drop down lyrics. Only you can accompany me to take the Western Sutra. Only you can kill fairies and ghosts. Only you can kill demons and exorcise demons, only. You can protect me. Dot 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 dot. It's really oh 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 your mother's big song. This song is tortuous enough. Let Li Shu sing. She's afraid she's not going to kill me. For the safety of life, you have to fool. Chu Zi thought frantically about how to fool Li Shu. Seeing Chu Zi's eyes change, Li Shu beat a drum in her heart. Are you scared by my status as a female emperor? Finally, something can shock you. Xiao I San, now you. Don't talk. Wind. It's the wind. I feel the wind. Chu Zi closed his eyes, tilted his head back slightly, and opened his arms, as if waiting for something. Li Shu was stunned by him, is there wind? Why didn't I feel it? 
Nope. Your heart is not pure, Shu is that your qualifications do not allow you to feel the slight change in the environment. But I feel it, it's the wind. That gust of wind tugged at my heartstrings, and I suddenly felt the changes in heaven and earth, and I had an epiphany in my heart. However, I still have one chance to go. As long as I have this opportunity, I think I can feel the power of the wind. Chu Zi looked at Li Shu and said seriously. Li Shu's face was full of suspicion and did not believe it at all. Cultivation is gradual, how can you have an understanding without laying a good foundation? And that's not how the perception came from. That requires quite a rich life experience, and a moment of inspiration to be possible. Accumulate thick and thin. How can you be blown by the wind and realize the power of the wind? What's more, there was no wind in the spirit beast pavilion at all. Li Shu, are you willing to help me? Li Shu was taken aback, you. How do you know my name? Quote. The time of acquaintance is not short, but Li Shu has not told Chu Zi his name. She had planned to wait until the contract was signed. At that time, she and Chu Zi will meet naked, and there will be no more secrets to speak of between them. After all, signing a contract implies some degree of soul sharing, including memories. Wind. It was the wind that told me. Li. Chu slowly changed from being suspicious just now to being suspicious. How can I help you? Let your singing drive the rhythm of my body and feel the power of the wind. In layman's terms, you sing. I can epiphany the power of the wind from your song. But I won't. It doesn't matter, I listen to what you just sang very well. The voice is gentle, like a heavenly fairy in the world. If it was touted by others, Li Shu would only scoff, but when the same words came out of Chu Zi's mouth, there was a hint of sweetness in her heart. A long, long time ago. The wind power of this song is not strong. But I'll only use this one. It's okay, I'll teach you. The name is oh 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 your mother's size. Ha, huh. no, 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 it's called only you. Chu Zi scratched his head a little embarrassed, and then his eyes were empty, and he read the lyrics given to him by the system. Combined with his incomplete voice, Li Shu said that he was quite tormented. Only you can accompany me to the Western scriptures. Quote quote dot 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 quote dot 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 quote. Li, Shu, are you sure it's a song? And not the howl of some kind of animal? Li Shu expressed great doubts about whether Chu Zi was fooling her. But looking at Chu Zi's serious appearance, it doesn't look like lying. Could it be this song oh 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 your mother's head? Blah blah. Could it be that this song is really a big secret? Although Li Shu didn't quite believe it, she also secretly remembered it. I'll go back and study it and come back tomorrow. Chapter 10 After returning to the bedroom, Li Shu's brows were furrowed. The more she thought about it, the more she felt that vomiting Lei Yu was more like the howl of an animal. Right, isn't Xiao Ai's classmate an animal? Although he is a spirit beast, even a first-generation divine beast, he is also an animal after all. Could this voice be a force hidden in his bloodline calling him? Quite possibly. It is not that the Tian Yuan continent has never had such an existence. Didn't the legendary four divine beasts activate the power in the bloodline as they grew step by step? Thinking of this, Li Shu began to chant those lyrics. Only you can accompany me to the West Jing. Li Shu. It's so embarrassing. This is completely unspeakable. Li Shu was hesitating and hesitating, but for Chu Zi's wind power, she finally sang it with a red face. With the qualifications of the female emperor in her previous life, it is simply not too simple to learn a song. But she didn't play awkward. Dot dot dot. It was late at night. Inside the dean's office, Xiao Yu stood respectfully in front of the old dean's table. The old dean supported the table with his elbows, dragged his chin with his palms, and smiled very kindly. Behind him stood Zheng Bojin, who did not look very good picked up the teacup in his hand and took a sip before raising his head and asking. Classmate Xiao Yu, just go to teacher Zheng directly for anything, his opinion is my opinion. Hearing this, Zheng Bojin's face eased a lot. Lord Dean, I'm afraid that teacher Zheng can't be the master of this matter, so I came to you today. Oh, and teacher Zheng can't do the Lord's things. The old Dean turned around and glanced at Zheng Bojin, whose face turned black again, funny. Dean, Xiao Yu wants to contract the spirit beast in advance. Oh, this way, this matter is not urgent, as a new student, you still have to lay a good foundation, which will not harm you in the future. Xiao. You didn't know. 
but he heard that there were already freshmen who had already been to the Spirit Beast Pavilion. Although the freshman contract failed, the competitive spirit in his bones made Xiao Yu unwilling to succumb to others. If someone else can contract in advance, he must also enjoy the same treatment. And he has to succeed in the contract to prove that he is a worthy rookie king. Lord Dean, I think my foundation has been laid. I'm now a cultivator who is about to reach the intermediate level. Oh, this sound, oh, Xiao Yu was not able to do it on the spot. Oh, that's it. Why aren't you surprised? Why don't you freak out and praise me? Xiao Yu had already thought about how to be modest, but he never expected that the old Dean would not react. Master Dean, you may not have heard clearly just now, I said that I will soon become an intermediate cultivator. Oh, it has only been less than a month since he entered the school, and he can break through from a trainee cultivator to an intermediate cultivator, which is indeed a very good talent. In the past, the old dean would definitely be surprised and regard Xiao Yu as the key training object of this session. However, the old dean had already seen Li Shu. Compared with Li Shu, Xiao Yu is a harmless little cutie. I'm bullish on you. The old dean spoke lightly, and did not want to mention Li Shu's affairs, he was afraid of hurting Xiao Yu's self-esteem. To be fair, Xiao Yu is also a rare talent. Lord Dean, you double standard. I'm not convinced. Why can other freshmen go to the Spirit Beast Pavilion and I can't? Is it because I am less qualified than others? Or is my current strength not enough for me to go to the Spirit Beast Pavilion? But if you can say one, I shall you will not let a single fart go, turn around and leave. After hearing this, the expressions of the old Dean and Jung Bojin immediately became very strange. Whether your qualifications are bad depends on who you compare with. Compared with other trainees, it can be said that he is a genius, but compared with Li Shu. Forget it, no comparison, no comparison. After all, my little sister-in-law was immediately a spirit-level cultivator, and she also said that she would tell me about her cultivation experience. What do you want to do? I also want to go to the Spirit Beast Pavilion to contract the Spirit Beast in advance, and I want to contract the Spirit Beast that failed the newborn. Xiao Yu said proudly. So, the old Dean pondered, touching his chin. A moment later, yes, Lord Dean, this, isn't it, Xiaoshu, she, the. Old Dean waved his hand, interrupting Jung Bojin's suggestion. Turn around and keep giving him a look. The academy has always been fair and cannot deprive others of their rights for the sake of one student. Looking at the old Dean's crowded eyebrows, Jung Bojin understood his good intentions. If Li Xu signed the Goose Yellow Beast, not only would he not get the slightest benefit, but he might even be dragged down by it. A generation of emperors cannot sink. As for this Xiao Yu classmate, he was just a tool person used by the old dean to eliminate Li Xu's signing Goose Yellow Beast. Although the college adheres to an open and fair attitude, it still focuses on cultivating students with good qualifications. This is the rule that the academy has almost laid out on the surface. Especially an emperor like Li Xu is even more important. Let Xiao Yu sign the Goose Yellow Beast, although it may pit him. Pit it, pit it. After figuring this out, Jung Bojin agreed. Tomorrow morning, I will take this so-called Xiao Yu to the Spirit Beast Pavilion. Early in the morning, it was not yet dawn. The old Dean touched the Spirit Beast Ball and released his S-grade Spirit Beast. Open Black Lens Bracket Monster. Close Black Lens Bracket Open Black Lens Bracket Race. Beast Close Black Lens Bracket Open Black Lens Bracket Age. 250. Close black lens bracket open black lens bracket bloodline, S. Close black lens bracket open black lens bracket attribute, water, spirit. Close black lens bracket open black lens bracket skill, nightmare realm close black lens bracket the. Huge spirit beast, is as docile as a kitten. As soon as he came out, he stretched his head to the old dean's face and rubbed it affectionately. There was endless softness in the eyes of the old dean, and he said softly. Link to that little building with your nightmare realm. Just a hint, I'm afraid it will cause Xiaoshu to be alert. Wei nodded, and a trace of spiritual fluctuations spread towards the small building where Li Xu was. The old dean's heart mentioned his throat eyes, for fear that Li Xu would find out. However, Li Xu was singing awkwardly at the moment. When the spiritual power was extremely nervous, it did not detect the existence of the monster. Seeing that there was no movement on Li Xu's side, the old dean let out a long sigh of relief. Bojin, I will give you hope for the wind, you must hurry. 
It's less than two hours before dawn. Fast, Zhang. Bojin acted like a thief, pulling Xiao Yu to rush to the Spirit Beast Pavilion. The Dean of the Heavenly Exploding Academy actually got up early in the morning to look at the wind. The first year tutor of the Heavenly Exploding Academy actually sneaked to the Spirit Beast Pavilion like a thief. Wang Xiaoyu, a newcomer to the Exploding Heaven Academy, was actually dragged away like a dead dog. In addition to being too slow because Xiaoyu was too slow, Zheng Bojin was also retaliating for his contempt for himself last night. If they hadn't seen it with their own eyes, no one would have believed that this scene would happen in the Exploding Heaven Academy, one of the seven great academies of the Tian Yuan continent. What is even more unexpected is that what caused all this will actually be a new birth, plus a small goose yellow beast with mottled blood. At this time, he was sleeping. At this time, she was singing awkwardly. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.